the area slowly does get back on its feet after Friday's storm. We do need to keep our eye on the possibility of yet another nor'easter heading our way. Meteorologist Lauren Casey says Tuesday into Wednesday is possibly when we might see Mother Nature packing another punch for us, Lauren. Yes, it is looking increasingly likely that we will see another nor'easter as we head into midweek, and we're still dealing with the residual effects from Friday's nor'easter with these elevated wind speeds, another windy day, winds gusting to 36 miles per hour in Philadelphia, near 40 in Mount Pocono, gusting into the middle 30s in Atlantic City, and it's still quite blustery out there right now with winds gusting up to 32 miles per hour in Philadelphia, 28 miles per hour in Atlantic City, and yes, Eyeing up another nor'easter that is looking likely to bring us rain and wet snow and looking like a prolonged period of wet snow again likely. So we certainly could see some accumulations less though of a wind threat. That's the good news this time. As usual, the winds will be concentrated on the highest winds right along the coast. Whereas with Friday storm, we had 60 mile per hour wind gusts widespread across the area, including up into the Poconos. But we still have the potential for some downed and uprooted trees as we head into Wednesday one because the ground is very saturated and two because of all the damage already done by the winds on Friday. So we'll talk more about this nor'easter potential and if we could see shovelable snow coming up in your full eyewitness forecast in just a few, Natasha. All right, Lauren, thank you so much. Now with another nor'easter right around the corner, it is a good time to download the CBS 3 mobile weather app and then you can get the latest weather headlines right on your smartphone. Download it for free from the App Store or Google Play.